Hi Scorpio, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Let's go ahead and get into it. Thank you God for blessing Scorpio with a clear, concise message from you. Alright, let's see what the week holds for you Scorpio. What's going on for my Scorpios? Okay, so it opens up with the Four of Pentacles. Very nice. Looks like someone you could be famous or you could be infamous. You're coming to some newfound wealth. Yeah, could be famous. Okay. Um, people look up to you, what you post, what is out there, what is on social media, what's on some type of mass media production or some type of technology, electronic. I don't know. You get um, people are looking up to whatever it is you put out. They're looking forward to it. It could have something to do. I heard burlesque or nudity or femininity or nudity of, you know, the feminine body. Um, let's see, because in the, the fours govern women, children, roots, you know, self-care. So some of you could be taking time for self-care also. Uh, let's see, what is the advice here? So some of you could be, yeah. The chariot card, do for self, be self-directed, self-focused right now. You can't be focused on each and every other thing and person and place. In order to make this grand achievement, to achieve some short-term goals, you're going to have to really be focused on you. Nothing more, nothing less. That's what the chariot card says. You may come off as self-centered, maybe even a taker. But in order to, you know, make these monumental achievements, you have to do it. Let's see what the outcome is here for Scorpio. You could be looking at what someone else posts, maybe an Aquarius person. The King of Cups, there's somebody in love. Somebody is wanting to go towards someone and declare something or um, travel towards someone. Somebody's trying to stay focused on work, but there's their heart is filled with love, devotion, and compassion for. Could be you, Scorpio. Let's see. Yeah. Maybe a fixed sign, Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, like yourself. So this is you. You know, it's like you want to kind of um close out a cycle, a cycle of being apart is what I'm hearing. You might want to apologize and do the right thing or this is what someone wants to do in terms of you. They see you posting or you see someone posting and you see someone getting, you know, all types of achievements and moving forward. It's like you want to go back to them and close this out. Uh, be truthful, be honest, be just, be fair. Yeah, and have expansion. You want to take the lead on this. You want separation between you and someone else, maybe a feminine energy to end, or if you're the feminine energy, you have a masculine energy wanting separation to end, wanting the fight to end. So, yeah, that's what you've got going on this week. It's like somebody's want to, they see you on your platform getting a lot of shine, you know, and they're like, uh, I need an opportunity to talk to this Scorpio because um, how I'm feeling is very emotional and I need to... I need to be, um, I need to be in your presence. Or this is how you feel about somebody else. Let's see. So yeah, for Scorpio. Okay, yeah, perfect timing. Okay, perfect timing, and then abundance. It's like somebody's got a lot of love and overwhelming and overflow of love, devotion, emotion for a particular person. But somebody's waiting for the right time to maybe make a move waiting for the right time or a right opportunity because somebody's getting a lot of attention okay this is what i have for you scorpio if it resonates for you let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section go over to the website and book your own reading there ask a question or two by texting it to the number below you can also catch me live every tuesday thursday and sunday night 9 30 p.m eastern standard time um thank, thank you scorpio take care have a really good week